understand when proofreading a book or implementing the changes there is a procedure which I would love to follow there are many places where we have um, instructions for what to do so we had the word usually I use Unicode Devanagari fonts but in special cases because of the aesthetical value of some fonts I use non Unicode fonts in this case it is uh, based on a Paris font uh, it is based on the encoding Sanskrit 1.2 um, so here I have the PDF and the instruction to delete a uh, matra. Here I have found the same in the source text. And if I would for so first I'd never make changes, almost never make changes on my own. I have to approve them first. So I copy past the word to. Uh, txt file and in this case as it is non unicode it looks like gibberish okay so what i do is i convert it first sanskrit one two to unicode okay um the problem is and I'm not quite sure where to delete the kahe so I could do it like this but I could go wrong as well so what I do is I open it in a new win window um, I convert it def to trans I delete what has to be deleted I convert it back to Devanagari and uh, okay, so here it is the before and after and page number. So this is the way I can actually propose changes because just showing the PDF will not help much. Okay, it's good for my reference, but it's far from enough. Okay, a similar case here. Um, I copy past the word. I open it. Um, I um, Sanskrit one two. Okay, that was on page four. Before and we will have. Now it will run back to trans currently, and I should have had okay. So it's it's not about the text, it's about the font, it doesn't show karma correctly. I have seen this issue before, so actually, it's not a um, text issue, it is font issue. It is font issue, which I will try and ask Mihail to fix. Okay. Uh, well, this is not what I wanted. So, this is the way I fix, I have the page number. And what to replace with what then I then only I can find it quickly so actually in this case I could not even find it quickly because uh, it's in Unicode here but in the text it's not Unicode so if I would want it really easy to find I would have to add like this and then I can I can find it easily otherwise it's like just for how it looks but not how it actually is there in the code so it can't be fine found anyway 
um, that's about it so what to replace with what to replace is the only quick solution of fixing mistakes because in a PDF there can be a lot of things and they don't help directly much <laughs>